As many military units prepare in case they are activated to deploy overseas, a big part of planning is family matters. Yeah, many soldiers have families, whether dual military couple, a single parent, or one partner in active duty. Fox 44's Allison Fox O'Connor, she joins us now in the studio after speaking with a Fort Hood couple who are both active duty soldiers. Allison, what do they have to say? Well, Adam, Wendy and William Talton are both master sergeants with the 1st Cav Division on Fort Hood. Now, here's how they handle their family and military lives, especially when they're away from home. Wendy and William Talton are a dual military couple stationed at Fort Hood, both with the 1st Cavalry Division. The Army wants you to be prepared for short and long term. And that's what the family care plan is there for. They are also parents to three children, with the fourth on the way. And there are times when both of them are away from home, whether on field training missions, rotations, or deployments. It's a little bit harder just because you have to prepare yourself, but at the same time, you have to more prepare the children. The Army requires all soldiers to have a family care plan in place for when they leave home. Wendy and William have had to figure out what works for their family. We basically thought about uh, which family would, I guess, which family member would be okay with the age group of the child. And it's just, it's different. Like, every situation is different for everybody, and that's kind of how we tailored our movements to travel to leave our kids. The Talons also told me that on top of planning for their kids when they are preparing to leave home, they also have to be there for their soldiers and their families. When you go um, step by step, they're, they're more aware of what's out there for them, like whether they need WIC service or if they need any kind of other care within other states, they're allowed to do that. Like some don't know what they can and can't do. They finish by saying there are ups and downs to how their lives operate as a military family, but it has helped them grow with their children and their soldiers. William will be retiring from the Army after 26 years of service soon, and both parents are looking forward to their oldest son entering high school. In the studio, I'm Allison Fox O'Connor, Fox 44 News. Thanks, Allison. All right, a big part of the COVID debate so far, Waco ISD School Board